best best almond or oat milk that you could ever buy milk milk so we're going to the ICA and then we're gonna go to the Dela Cruz collection which I believe is in the design district if I'm not mistaken or maybe I'm completely wrong and it's somewhere else which it's probably the case so yeah let's go see some art Just got coffee. Now we're headed to the Dela Cruz collection. This whole piece is made out of gum. Oh, oh damn, that's pretty cool. Why is he squishing her boob like that though? This guy is so pretty. Just kidding, it's a painting. Just, my camera's a little. Just finished sculpture class. I got a lot of work done. And honestly, I'm a little exhausted. I'm pulling up to my studio now so I can finish painting this piece. I left the studio early. I was exhausted from, from sculpture, honestly, and I didn't bring my laptop, totally forgot it at home. And so I was gonna use my phone to look at the reference photo, but I was tired from sculpture. I needed new brushes, and so I left, and I'm currently on my way to Jerry's to get new brushes. So we're gonna do that, and then go home, relax, meditate, eat some good food, maybe take a bath, and just get ready for tomorrow. Okay, got these brushes, which I'm very excited to use. And I got some palette knives. Now it's time to relax. It's 8 a.m. Currently setting in a bit of uh, some morning Miami traffic. Today I'm gonna finish my painting. I've been swarmed with sculpture work, so I really need to get ahead of that. I'm gonna make dinner now. Ooh, forgot I had this Olipop. When I was leaving my studio, there were people like, installing fire alarms in the ceiling, and I'm a little worried because I'm <laughs> wasting energy. A little worried because whenever you take the ceiling panels off, dust flies all over the place, and I just painted, and it's wet. 
and I don't want dust to stick to the wet paint. A little concerned about that, but I guess we will, we will see. I'm gonna make my famous egg soup. It sounds gross, but don't knock it till you try it. If I can get this open. Let's see. Let's see what we can put in here. Two eggs. And we're also gonna make this a miso soup. Is that gross? I don't know, but I don't care. something just flew on my eyebrow. One annoying thing about me is that I leave my fridge open a lot, so. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, <laughs> beautiful. Ooh. Little goes a long way. That's it, that's egg soup. All right, I just got done with sculpture class like an hour ago, or maybe 30 minutes ago. And the thought of doing this painting right now, like finishing this painting is, <sighs> I was using a jigsaw for like over three hours straight and my hand hurts terribly. I'm gonna go get an afternoon pick me up to wake me up, shake me out of this funk. So I'm gonna get some coffee and probably a vegan cookie, honestly. I need like sugar to wake me up. So we're gonna do that. I'm going to this place called Special Tea. They have really good vegan cookies. So we're gonna see. I'm losing my mind. Help me. When I walked in there, it literally looked like a dungeon. And there's a lot of uh, students there. So it looks like it's the place to hang out and study. It's pretty, it's pretty good. It's actually pretty fire. And the cookie, I already know the cookie fire as well. You see, it's crazy how that literally just changed my mood. This is a cookie in all of her glory. Beautiful. Back to the stew. Yesterday was a complete disaster. I mean, not really, but but yeah. Let's chat about it while I get ready for school today. Or school right now. Nothing went wrong, but I just was not satisfied with two things. My sculpture piece, which is a whole different video, and my painting, how I finished it. The thing is, it's not finished. That's the problem. Decided to try out this light wash situation, like what I did for my big piece, that was in my show in November of last year. And I knew going into that, that I was gonna take a risk. I knew what I was getting myself into. I am going to my studio now. Well, not right now because I have class at 10 o'clock. We're going to the museum that's on campus and having a tour done over there. But after that, I, I'm just gonna go straight to my studio and also ask my painting teacher for her opinion and see what she thinks. Cause it's a big dilemma. 
Anyways, um, yesterday I woke up feeling like a million bucks, ready to conquer the day, and today I just want to crawl in a hole. This used to be a sweater, I cut it off, and then these camo pants I thrifted, and the shoes are C315s, I think, from New Balance. To like be too much. I think maybe much. air is a better idea. Air. So make it look like air. Uh, get what how to paint clouds and stuff. <laughs> okay. You know, and then the, yeah. get rid of the, the blue clouds yeah. around them. Uh huh. The the jeans too are are. I know. They're not they're not fun either yet. Yeah. So the the jeans are looking kind of snotty too. Yeah. So um sort of come in a little bit. I think your highlights are sucking. <laughs> then you do that football helmet, so I'm confused. <laughs> yeah, I know. I think, because I painted the jeans first, so I think I like just was in a mood or something. Like just the cloth part, like not the little white part. I don't know. So that's it for this video. Stay tuned for next week's video because it might involve something a little different. Not so much painting, but maybe sculpting. We'll see. I hope this video inspired you in some way, shape, or form. And yeah, stay cool and I will see you in the next video.